What's good, YouTube? Your boy Danny Mac coming to you for another video. This time we're going to decide who we should pick between Justin Jackson and Ryan Arcidiacano. I don't know I'm not pronouncing that right. The day eight choices. So let's go ahead and take a look, shall we? Well, first thing you need to get 10, 10 four clutch time, 10 four, Lord have mercy, 10 four pointers in clutch time online or offline over multiple games to get the um, pack. Pack market. Bracket Busters Day 8. All right, so we got Justin Jackson. I mean, on first look, you would, you know, Ryan is an undersized 6'3 point guard. Well, I mean, 6'3 is not undersized, but it is now at the end, you know, in the game. So, yeah. So just, you know, yeah. <laughs> He's got all the hot spots. He's 999 on both ways. Got excellent, you know, excellent shooting. 95, three point, 96 mid range. Only got 40 on the dunk, which means he probably will lay it up most of the time. 95s on all the ball handle stuff. It looks similar to what Jared Jack looked like yesterday. 80s, if I go look, it might be sim very similar. 96 on all the speed stuff, 94 lateral quickness. So a very good card, you know, a very good card. The tendency says what? So yeah, so, so driving the tendency is zero. So he's laying it up because Jared Jack had an 80 driving in Tennessee, but when I played with him, he laid it up just every time, like four or five times in a row. So, yeah. Um, Justin Jackson. Oh, I'm just messing up. Don't confirm. Yeah, I'm about to press the wrong button. I messed up yesterday and pressed the wrong button. So, Ryan Jackson. I'm sorry, Justin Jackson, excuse me. I'm just trying to pull him up on my computer here. So, they both won. Ryan has 39 goals, Justin has 38. Justin's got a 93 three-point shot, 80 on the drive and dunk, 90 free throw, 80, 80s in the ball handle stuff instead of 90s, 80s on the defense, 80 rebound, you know, 94 speed and acceleration, 90 lateral quickness, so not as good as Ryan per se, so, you know, it, it's a, uh, yeah, they both can play, now Ryan is 6'8", can play shooting guard, that's a big deal, so you got a 6'8 shooting guard with a 6'11 wingspan right there, that's very nice. And more, these cards are more help you probably, well, it depends on where you're at. It may help you now in your, your ultimate lineup, unlimited lineup. But I always remember these cards are like good for later on and limited when it's like you might have to do uh, one team or something. And, then, you know, maybe you'll decide, oh, I got this, you know, my Kings might be the one. Maybe that's your favorite team. Or they just, or Spurs may be the one with Ryan. So it just depends on um, what, you, what you're looking for there. I'm trying to see here. So the... The Hall of Fame badges. He's got Agent 3, Amped, Blinders, Catch and Shoot, Dead Eye, Guard Up, Limitless Range, Mini Magician, Clamp Breaker, Hyper Drive, Hyper Drive, and Quick First Step. So all of his are all of his are defense or offensive badges. Ryan's got Giant, Slayer, D, Dead Eye. Now he's got three defensive badges and eight eight offensive badges basically for the um for Hall of Fame, so interesting. So those are things that those are things to decide when you are deciding. Me, I am going to go with the six eight shooting guard. I mean, you know, yeah, that's that's what I'm going to do. So, and there we go. Confirm. Okay. <laughs> All right, you guys. Uh, let's see here. I can go ahead and just show you a little bit of the player itself in terms of just um. Well, I'm gonna make a video on him anyway, so I'll make a gameplay video on him, Justin. So I um, appreciate you guys checking out the video, man. If you're new to the channel, definitely hit the subscribe button for me. It'd be greatly appreciated. And definitely leave a like as well. Peace and love, y'all.